All right, what's going on guys? First of all, I want to thank you guys for the good amount of responses on my last video, the uh, fake video of me quitting YouTube. <laughs> it was just an April Fool's joke, so thanks for the great responses, guys. It really meant a lot to me, a lot more than you would probably think it, it does. <laughs> but anyways, this is a new series I want to start, but I do not want to start this series unless you guys are really into it and you would really like it. It's going to be... I guess basically like a tips and tricks. I really don't know what I'm going to call it, but this first one is going to be on Village. It is not a full gameplay. It's just a couple clips I got out of the game, and it's basically what I'm thinking in my mind, and common sense wise, spawn wise, uh, grenade places, maybe some throwing knives in the future, but I got two uh, games right now that I can go through about learning where people are spawning, where people are coming from, where they're going to be running to, fighting against campers, and stuff like that. And hopefully you guys will be very interested in it. And so, like I said, this first one's on Village, and you will be seeing it very soon. So leave some comments down below and let me know uh, basically what you think about this idea. So, yeah, enjoy. So, guys, I edited this as much as I could just to break it down to you guys. And uh, on Village, this is my opening route. Normally, I will throw a grenade over this little building here. And as you see, that is pretty effective later, uh, but not at the moment. But I am trying to use my common sense in this game, and it tells me that there are always going to be freaking people here. I get one guy there, and I want to watch both ways as soon as we spawn here. And I'm, I'm just very sure of myself that there's going to be these guys just rushing on both of these ways and I'm using my teammates as an advantage also and looking at the mini map more than I really do look at the regular map and I get stunned don't worry about that guys it's going to happen just lay still and and just try to see through those stuns as you know as much as you possibly can because those people are going to be coming around the corner whether they're going to be coming around fast or not and the second clip that was the opening part the second clip is going to be this bush and I hope you guys will remember this bush I mean it is a good place to hold off at but remember this bush that bush that's my bush <laughs> remember that bush because uh, there is a count you can counteract anything that happens in this game and I try to go sniper crazy with this I get one kill and go for the other one and it's just that uh, I'm not a sniper you know but uh so that bush is a decent place to hold off at they can shoot through it obviously and with this next clip I'm using my common sense to tell me this guy is sitting in this little church area over here my phone shut up he's sitting in that church area over there I use my predator missile I see him there again even if it's not the same person this tells me that they're gonna want to sit there a lot so I throw a grenade over there and what's gonna happen I get a double kill so this is more common sense and knowing that people are spawning over here and I just want to show you guys slow motion to where you can see exactly where I threw that grenade at so, you know, if you want to use that one in overhead view to show you the double kill I got here. And I just know they're going to be around this church. And unfortunately, I didn't get the guy that was camping in the church, but I still got a couple people. So if you just aim to the left a little bit more, then it's worth it. I mean, this game is very easy to figure out. And once again, I see him camping in that church. And, you know, obviously throwing the grenade, I was thinking, well, I got him, but I didn't. So uh, another line of sight, which is very good. Use this truck as a barrier. And you can see through the truck, especially after it's blown up. But, uh, you know, just pop them in the elbow. You can wall bang them, shoot through that wall right there, get a couple more people. And, you know, it's all to your advantage right here. Just use it to your advantage as much as you possibly can. Once you see people camping in one spot, most likely they're going to keep trying to run towards that spot. And uh, as you see, I saw that guy. He killed me right there. And I actually get another grenade. We're going to slow this one down for you also uh, here in a second. Uh, a payback right there slow it down here and this is from that bush that you saw a second ago this was actually pretty interesting to me as I saw this and this works with the simtex I don't know about a regular frag grenade uh, they have different timings and stuff but here's the overhead view you can see the guy running around the corner and it blows up right as it hits the top of the tree and that's enough force to kill the guy so hopefully you guys enjoyed this if you guys want to see more uh, this and just remember this is my first video uh, doing this type of series so hopefully you guys enjoyed this I was kind of you know not as good at it as I will probably be in the next few videos so the next one is Bakura if you guys are interested but let me know in the comments below if you guys really are interested or not in seeing a series like this done by me uh, because I actually enjoyed this and I want to help you guys out as much as I possibly can without 
just doing your regular gameplay commentary crap that I usually do. So I want to switch it up a little bit and get my channel going a little bit more and get a little bit more well known and helping you guys out at the same time. So if you haven't already, click the subscribe button here to subscribe right at the top. A previous video on the left and mystery video on the right. Follow me on Twitter, guys. Leave a comment below letting me know if you want to see some more stuff. I'll mix it up and get a little bit of a variety in there. Maybe we'll play some different game types and stuff like that. And if you guys want to, y'all can leave some suggestions. So with that, I've been Snowball. You guys have been awesome. Thanks for watching, and see you guys. Peace.